All right, I'm on hole number four of the 2020 Summer Major. I'm in the opening round of the Ricky Division. I'm in my 99 account, so I got some mid-level mid -level clubs here. Hole number four is going to be Southern Pines. Hole number three. It's par four right here. All right, they have not changed this one up. So I'm hitting out into this area out here. I'm just doing a layup. And then I'm trying to bring it home with a sniper. So I'm going to bring my, let's see what I got here, what my options are. I could bring a big topper there. Just trying to get out there. I'm going to bring a big, I'm going to bring a big topper and a sniper. Should have no problems getting it out there with that. And I'm going to bring a navigator just to help cut the wind down. I could pound it out there and trying to get in my short iron range, but the deal is, is that it's so important not to have any epic fails when you have lower developed clubs. Like the minimum score is super, super important. And I don't want to take any risks on these particular holes. I want to put myself in the spot so that I have a, a serious chance of putting into the hole for Eagle, but I want to do that with the minimal amount of risk. Because it's more important that I give myself a, a super good shot at Eagle every time than it is that I give myself a long iron shot at Eagle. I mean, I'm not, I don't have to get, I don't have to get all the way up there. A little teeny bit of curl on it. Two, three. It's about a ring. I'm going to just lean up against the nubs, maybe just a little bit more and curl. Hitting it perfect. Just try and bleed it up there. Get it as close to those shadows as possible, but I don't have to get way up there. What I don't want to do is overshoot that into that rough. <laughs> That's why I put the little bit of curl on it, because the farther you can get to the right, the longer the fairway is. <clears throat> That was a little bit too close for comfort, so maybe not quite all of the top spin. Or a little bit more curl, but the where the bounces were at, if you put too much curl, that second bounce where the curl is starting to come into play is on the same line as the sand. So if you put too much curl in it, you're actually putting your second bounce unless you put overpower on it, which is why I'm not why I'm trying to do the layup. My opponent's going to be in short iron range from right there. That's fantastic. Fantastico. It's 4-2. I'm going to do a 4-4 four, four adjustment. I'm in my Saturn. Excellent. 4-4 four, four at 1.9 per ring. Get up here so I can see. 4-4 four, four at 1.9 per ring. So there's 3-8. That leaves me 6. And that's about a third. So 2 and a third rings. Hitting it perfect. Let's see if we can get it in the cup. Give ourselves a look. Just a bit outside. Didn't over hold it. So at the 5%, I over pulled. This is what I hate about this hole is, is that there's times I come in here and I'm like, man, I need to do a little bit of an adjustment. I do the little bit of an adjustment and I hit it again and it's like, wow, I over pulled it. And I do a little bit of an adjustment and it's like, wow, I over pulled. And I don't do an adjustment. It's like, wow, I needed to do an adjustment. This hole pisses me off. <laughs> I think I have had more success just coming out here in one on one and just doing my normal ring numbers. And I've definitely had more success doing the backspin shot that my opponent did. Getting up in there and doing a backspin shot with your short iron or your long iron than I have uh, trying to run it up through that rough bump. That uh, rough bump used to not be there. So the only, you really, your best shot at getting in the hole was a backspin shot. 
But when they put that rough bump area in there, I switch to the rough bump and it just feels like I just don't have as much success on this hill as I used to. But if you're doing that layup, unless you're bringing a guardian and you've got one that's got a little bit of ball guy to it, if you want to do the backspin shot, you need to get up into the shadow so that you're, you can engage your long iron on the green. And like my opponent, if you can hit past the shadows, then you can get into your short iron range where you can bring out a claw or a thorn. You're going to get your thorn first, obviously, because it's a lower, lower tour club than your thorn or your claw, but your claw is going to get developed faster once you start going up the ranks. Your claw is not a bad club. Doesn't have quite as much stuff once the uh, thorn gets upper developed, but it's got some good stuff. Let's play this hole. Let's let's play this hole so we can feel. Can I even get up in there? No. Yeah, let's try the let's try the shot where we're trying to use that funnel. Let's see if. Uh, See if we can get the ball to hit into that funnel. Maybe white ring off at my red line. Three six. Max curl. Hitting it perfect. See if we can catch that funnel and get any movement to come down towards the hole. A little too much backspin. That's the type of area I'd like to be in order to get in that funnel, but I probably like one less backspin. I'd have thrown it up higher on that hill so when it came into the bowl, it would weave and bob back down to the cup. There's a spot out there. I think that there's a pretty good spot out there if you can catch it just right. I think where they're hitting with the well that was them taking the wind out they had that top spin in there it looks like it's it that may be all right if they got a lot of curl so it doesn't fly up that's going to look pretty good it's going to pick up a lot of speed and get down as long as it doesn't and it 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 washed out if it would have had a little less, it would have hit that and then went back towards the middle and did the little weave and bob. But it actually, when it came down the hill, it went over the top of the other side of the creek and ended up on the shore. Good luck in the tournament. Good luck. That hole has been changed. So that hole, that shot coming in that I took right there, thats I've only taken that shot a couple of times. But there is a nice little trough there. All right, that's hole number four of the 2020 Summer Major in the opening round of the Ricky Division. Thanks for watching.